They'd be like metre waves, I think. Yeah. All right, we're back on Cryo Bay, another Sunday sailing with Venture Off Road Australia 4x4 in the sailboat. No 4x4 today. It's a little bit windier than what we've been doing in the past. We thought we'll have a go. We'll put a reef in the mainsail and use the smaller jib straight from the outset. It's blowing about 11 knots at the moment and gusting probably around 13, 15, maybe even a little bit more. Uh, conditions are a little bit choppy, so it's a bit interesting. But we're doing all right. Rachel's a little bit nervous. But we'll see how we go. We're just going to kind of play around in fairly close today. I would have, I would like to head out to Clifton Springs and check out the swimming on the beaches out there. But I think given how windy it is and you know we are very much still learning, I think we'll just stay in close to shore today, do some laps around Karaya Bay and then we'll head back over to that main eastern beach that we've been swimming at and do some more swimming and have some lunch over there again see how we go it's meant to be about 35 degrees but it's only 28 now so it's pretty pleasant a bit windy it's all good keep us on our toes and give us a bit of a challenge what have we got we've got 3.9 knots of boat speed at the moment which doesn't feel like it it doesn't does it no. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Once again, I'm oblivious to the fact that I've forgotten to disconnect the boom support wire, but we'll get there eventually.
right, you're good now. How about that? That's like just fully like 10. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, cool. Oh. Two jibes. It's a fairly strong wind. It's going pretty well. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you were going to jump on this side yeah. there. Like, now you're still going to be on that side. Yeah. <laughs> I want to be on whatever side the sails aren't. Getting ready to pull down the sails and pull into the beach and have some lunch. Hey Am, in a minute we're gonna let down that sail and I want you guys to pull it down. Oh, I've gotta let this go, don't I? So just hang on to it as it comes down, just sort of bundle it up on your lap. Okay guys, we'll let it down now. Probably a good idea. Now that I've disconnected the boom support, I really should have connected the topping lift. In fact, in future, I'll just do that from the outset. We learned an important lesson here about choosing an anchorage with protection from the wind and swell. I've always been one for learning the hard way. Still, we had fun. Madness, I tell you. Rocking and a rolling on the sea. Got the paddle board out again. I can't stand up on it though, it's too rough. You should but try again. I'll try man. so you can all have a good laugh. Kneeling's alright. Paddleboard, Karaya Bay, Diddy and Chicken Schnitzel Roll. Doing it tough. Got Rach to thank for the food. She's doing a pretty good job in there cooking in these rolly wavy conditions. Never ate lunch on a paddleboard before. That's something new. I feel like I'm at a buffet at the bar. Someone just needs to pass me a drink. 
Are you having fun? Yes. <laughs> Are you having fun? Sure. <laughs> sure. That was a bit of a dry response. Probably a bad idea wearing my sunglasses, I'll end up losing Yeah. I'm actually managing to stand up. Back salad again, I think we must have spent three or four hours almost just swimming and hanging out there at the main beach, had some lunch. It's been pretty wavy, pretty rolly there, uh, to be expected in a northerly wind. Now we're just going to do a bit more sailing and make our way back to the jetty, I suppose, or back to the boat ramp. Bit of a win. It does feel like that's picking up now. We're good. 13 knots of wind, apparently, and we're doing about what we're doing? five knots. Can we point a bit closer to the wind? Pretty nicely. heel there. Sail's not doing too bad. Again, I think we could have a little better shape in the sail. Not too bad. Blame you for 
tipping. Huh? I blame you for tipping. I did do it. So <laughs> what are you doing, baby? Hey guys, are you sleeping? No. Yeah. Pretty happy with the decision to put the reef in the main and run the working jib number two jib I think it is rather than the Genoa that we have been running. Oh. It's definitely been more challenging sailing today. Certainly not relaxing sailing. I think oh, Rachel no, no. can vouch for that, not relaxing. No, not relaxing. <laughs> but it's been good. I think we'll it's been less scary than I thought on yeah. the way back. Yeah. After rolling for hours in the boat <laughs> while we were parked. Thank you. Parked. <laughs> 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 All right, that's pretty much the end of our day sailing. I'm going to start the outboard just so that we are ready for the motor and then I'm going to go forward and pull down the jib as Rachel lets out the jib halyard and then I'm going to stay forward and then we'll pull down the main sail and then all the while Craig's going to hang on to the tiller because that's what he's been doing so well. See how this one goes. We don't need any more speed. Sales are down, and now we'll just motor back into the ramp. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hit the like and the subscribe button, and we'll see you next time, whether we're in the boat or in the four-wheel drive, but somewhere out there exploring, because that's what we love to do. Hope to see you there. Bye.